اینجا شهر کنت در جنوب شرقی کشور انگلستان هستیم انجمن افغانستان و آسیای میانه که مدتی 25 سال می شود در خدمت هموطنان خیش قرار دارد و بنیانگذار آن دکتر صاحب نور الحق نسیمی می باشد امروز به سلسله افتتاح دفاتر خیش در سرت و سری کشور انگلستان به شهر کنت امراه با امراهانشان آمده اند تا یک نمایندگی خیش را در اینجا افتتاح نماید We at Main in Maidstone, we are, we are very open to me. We have a lot of people, different backgrounds, different nationalities live here, and uh, we, we pride ourselves. Uh, large Nepalese community, a lot of uh, Asian people here, and, uh, and you know, we welcome them. In, into our um, communities. of the Afghanistan and Central Asian Association uh, Integration Project in Kent. Uh, my name is Shabnam Nassini and I am a former government policy advisor to the Minister of Afghan Resettlement and Minister uh, for Refugees. Your presence today signifies the importance of our collective efforts to build a supportive and inclusive community. First of all, I wish to extend my heartfelt gratitude to Dr. Nassini, MBE, the founder of Afghanistan and Central Asian Association. His vision and dedication have been driving, <coughs> driving force behind the establishment of this new branch. His journey from being a migrant himself to the founder of ACAA <coughs> is a testament to resilience and potential within every individual who arrives in the UK and seeking for a better life. The ACA was founded 25 years ago after my family came to the UK as refugees from Afghanistan to escape the Taliban. It was a very difficult journey across Europe and then eventually we arrived in Lewisham in the southeast of London. It, um, and that's where this charity was founded. And the main aim is to support the integration of Afghan refugees in the UK um, through English classes for adults, Saturday school for children to help them with their school subjects, free legal advice on housing, immigration, family issues, women's empowerment, um, helping victims of domestic violence and running women's groups, employment support to help them with finding a job or setting up a small business. It's good to see so many people here because quite often when you get new things start up only a few come and then gradually it builds up but you've got a great, um, you've got great support here tonight and um, hopefully that support will continue whilst you're here and doing exactly what Darius has been uh, outlining. Um, we, we have a very... Um, open um, contact with people here. Um, we, uh, we do it, encourage the mixing of cultures. Because in my working life, I've, I've worked in the Middle East and many parts of the world, um, and everybody you meet is always wel welcoming. And I, th I think I can see that here, that pe people are welcoming us here. And we, likewise, we welcome you. And um, you know, if, you, if there's uh, any, any, you've got three councillors here, any problems and you want advice, then um, I'm Councillor Gordon Newton. Stuart Jeffrey. Stuart Jeffrey. And Councillor Laurie Cleeter. So now, now you know, and they're, they're all different parties um, that uh, work in Maidstone. So, first of all, thank you very much 
poor than the mayor of Kent, the councillors, the local community groups, the beneficiaries. And thank you, a special thank you to the British people. Without your support, I wouldn't be able to do so much. The hospitality, the equal opportunities available in Great Britain. I remember my personal experience when I came to the UK, my views about British society completely was different. I didn't know anything but the British values, about the history, the greatest culture, how Great Britain is the first country promoting democracy, rule of law, equality, social justice around the world. So having an organisation such as the ACAA here um, is, is a real benefit um, to, uh, to us as well as to our communities. Um, so I, I must confess, I have, I'm still very much still learning uh, about the challenges facing refugees and asylum seekers um, and, and others who have chosen to live here.